my name is Henrik Hatsch and I work as a product manager for Qt. Today we will release our uh, source tree with the commit history to be open for the world to see. So if you go to qt.catorius.org you can download the entire source code and play with it. But you can also actually make improvements and submit these upstream to Qt software. When you submit a patch, they will be evaluated to see if they don't introduce any failures or any regressions to Qt. But they're also checked to see if they have a good C++ coding style, so other people can maintain it, read it easily. And if your patch passes the two, these two requirements, it'll be accepted into Qt. If the patch is large, it'll be evaluated against our roadmap to see if it fits with the direction we're going. Our roadmap is available in our web pages. It provides you with insight into the areas we're working on and the direction we're going in with Qt. And we've done this to enable two-way communication between developers and uh, our community. But we also want to enable the contributors to Qt to focus their efforts on areas that we're actively pursuing. But finally, it's also a way for people to be able to focus on functionality, which is in the main areas that Qt Software is not really actively focusing on. So we hope that you find the roadmap useful and that it will be a good source of community feedback and collaboration.